All right, Matt, good. Gotcha, brother. Nice work, buddy. Man, I love the new finish on this thing. It looks good, huh? I think it looks fantastic. Hey, welcome back, guys. Now, we are just wrapping up our work on this 2003 Silverado work truck for our buddy. Now, if you remember, he crashed up the back pretty badly, so we had to put a new bumper on it, a new side panel. We've got a new rear lift gate for it. Matt did some stuff with a turbo timer, changed the blower motor and the fan, we fixed it, yep. and fixed the front headlight. A lot of stuff happened in a very short period of time. The whole idea is when this truck is down, he's down, he's not making any money. The last piece of the puzzle in terms of the transformation back to a work truck, though, was the Fleet West load and go. This thing's back in a place, and now he can go back out on the road and make some money. I think the coolest thing about the Fleet West box is the fact that besides all the obvious things, you look at all the storage that you can have, oh, yeah. is the fact that it really gets rid of the need to have a dedicated work truck. You don't have to have two trucks now, right? One big box truck for work in one truck to haul everything and play in, you can have the, all the benefits of having one truck, basically, which is the big benefit of saving a lot of money. Yeah, I mean, look at the compartments in this thing. This is a huge slide-out drawer. I mean, you could put bodies in here if you wanted to. <laughs> you know, it rolls on and rollers nice and easy. It shuts, boom, safe and secure from prying hands, all your tools, all your supplies, and it locks in place. So the elements and other people can stay out of your stuff, which is really nice. Now, you notice the finish on this box. This is what they call the Sportsman. It's a new model for them, and it's great as the fact it's a little more versatile. It'll fit on a half-ton truck as well as this big full-ton truck, but the finish on it's really great. It's got that black look on the black truck, and it's that rugged, you know, truck bed liner stuff. You match that with the diamond plate, and this thing's pretty much indestructible. You know what I like is to always tell the story about the guy that had the work truck with this box in the back of it. He crunched up the whole front end, right? Yeah. Truck wasn't running anymore, but he didn't lose any time at all on work because he just rented another truck, brought that truck over. They moved the box from the crunched up one to the truck that ran, but he didn't miss out on any work, man. That's the deal. Yeah, that's the whole key to this thing. You know, this is a, a work truck during the week for our buddy on the week Weekends, though he uses this truck to pull his toys it's a fifth wheel hauler you know takes this thing off with a forklift or he's even got those optional jacks and boom he's out having fun with the truck on the weekends that's what's really cool you know how it goes the wife's like I want to go out to the Japanese steakhouse but I don't want to take the work truck you're like okay honey boom you move the box off now she's happy because you're rolling down the road and you don't have all the tools going with you this is gonna save your marriage I'm telling you <laughs>